What's today's date? August 2nd, 2011. All right. We hit the dead ceiling and it's smooth sailing. Here we go, and I found a crab. Look at him. Do you want me to pinch you? No way. It doesn't hurt that no much. No fucking way. <laughs> Get that. Here. No fuck. The fuck. The fuck. <laughs> Jerry, don't lean back too far. Yeah, if you would just get that Could you move to the middle of the cabin, please? Okay. Here's me and the crab. I'm going to let him go. Do you want to hold him? No. <laughs> oh, come on! That's not my role in this video. <laughs> all right, all right. Okay, Mr. Crab, we're letting you go. I'd rather be crabby than hold Born crabby. Free. So free. As free as, as free the crabs crawl. Crab right. If it was the 60s, he'd be smoking crabgrass. Okay, we're canoeing. Um, yeah. And we're lost in the salt marsh. So we don't know where we're going. And uh, Jerry's videotaping us. No GPS. We have no GPS. We no have one cell phone that nobody wants to use. No flares to tell anyone that we're here. We have no chips embedded in, under our skin to pick anyone else up in case we're lost. If we only had a, um, are you watching to see if I'm in the, actually in the video? Yeah. If we only had an iPhone with GPS instead of this stupid camera, we'd be able to tell where we were. Was this like when we missed our exit on the LIU five times? Well, at least we didn't have 200 pounds of video equipment <laughs> that we had to worry about. We only had... Good point. Yeah. Not only did we have to worry about it, but we had a $10,000 debt to Hampshire on top of our deposit for the camera. Yeah. Jerry, can you kind of sit there? Okay, great. We're lost. We're still lost in the salt marsh. You want to get the back of your dad's head in this video, too? Sure. Okay. Great, just move the camera. Yeah. All right, do you want to say anything? Yeah, this is a little bit like uh, the uh, sudden death round of bumper boats. Those might be turns and not gulls. We're out of the labyrinth. Yeah. We're back on the highway. Big thing of water here. Besides, you have your own water bottle, right? My dad has it somewhere. Okay. How do you like this beach? It's very, very nice. Yeah. It's pretty. It's smaller compared to the one we went to in Long Island. Yes. Yes. It's a little bit bigger than Lake Wyola, though. But less traffic. Yes. Less people too. Yeah. And people didn't go sailing in Long Island. No. No. And not only did. Did we hang? Did you guess that because it was there's water everywhere in Cape Cod, you thought there might not they might not make any parks. But, but at the restaurant we were proved wrong. Although although the water park around here looks like it's more for younger kids rather than any everyone. From what I read anyway. Does that mean we can go to a water park for old people? Well, I'm sure New Hampshire has tons of water parks for old people. Yeah, but Cape Cod doesn't seem to. If I was lame, I probably could. Except I'm not lame, so I don't need a wheelchair. Mark's hungry. So am I. Alright. Thank you all. some doing but we made it we finally got here and we got to eat lunch what did you have uh i had a california wrap with double vegetables Woo! and you told me about the men's room situation yes 
Yep. And now we're going to walk out to the big ocean. Stage right. Try to catch one of these birds so we can eat their muscles. Okay. So, Jerry, what have you done on your uh, vacation so far? Uh, throughout the summer? No. This trip. Oh. Well, we drove to... Oh, do you want me to point the camera at me now? Yeah. Okay. Well, throughout, during the... So far, we drove yesterday from my house over to the Perrells. We visited with them, and we had a nice talk. We had a wonderful talk with Andy. We had a good up update on things, and... Uh, we got to share some stuff I don't really talk to him much about. Welcome to New England! I'm gonna keep my riptides close to the shore! Yeah. No sandbars in this neck of the woods. Kinda cold, huh? Like, um, the jokes he made about baby talk, and how I pointed out that a lot of things that I liked when I was younger, I find amusing now. I find more, even more amusing now. And, uh, because last night, and last night we had a delicious meal of chicken on the grill, salad, bread, and, uh, what else? How did you like the upstairs of shop therapy? What's that? And I, uh, and, um, we have a nice bedroom, too, and after dinner, me and Andy went out to, what's the town they called again? Provincetown! Oh, I thought that was what it's called, but I wanted to check in. We went out to P-Town for a pee. Yeah. <laughs> and boy, did we have a good one. Anyway, we went out to Provincetown, and walked around, went to a room, found some really nice shops. Shops you'd never ex you'd, you would never find in your area, especially if you're not from Cape Cod. Right. Yeah, this is including a town, a hippie store that yeah. contains everything there, every bad thing that there ever is you can do. Not everything. Well, not everything, but a, a lot, lot of things. Yeah, like drugs. Most of the good ones. Like drugs, that kind of stuff. Mm. Sex, sex yeah. and sex. Yep. There was a ton of sweet, there was a ton of bakeries and sweet ice cream places with sweets. And I ended up going to a bakery and getting a bright, a bright um, chocolate cake or something like that. How much was your chocolate mm. cake? It was around 10.65, I think. Yeah. Oh, I like to switch sides. Right now I'm just videoing and not paddling. There you go. We are headed back. So you guys have a nice paddle? We certainly did. Alright. We did. It was definitely the kind of a paddle that if you planned it out it wouldn't be nearly as fun. <laughs> well, good thing we didn't plan it too well then. That's right. Right. Yeah. We have some videos for now. Alright. Cut. Uh, Next. What button do I press? The same one.